guys, what's up? It's Megan, and today I am doing one of your guys' suggestions, uh, 22 question video thing. May, uh, asked by RCSO388, and maybe up there, and it was requested five months ago, but then apparently you said that you go to youtube.com slash message, I was like, there's something called that and then like I just now figure this out so like it's like night time for me it's 9 49 p.m. for me right now so when you look outside it's dark so I'm in my basement you can hear that thing right there so cuz I knew that if I was loud in my room because I'm a very loud person and I'm very because <laughs> that's what I do um I'm very loud and stuff so I would think that they would hear me my mom and my brother and they're sleeping right now that they would murder me if I was in my room and then I'm making a video down here and then y'all hear that the whole video I wonder if you can actually hear it but like it's making this sound it's very low compared to my beautiful voice so um in number one what is your favorite soft drink probably Pepsi Mainly, I don't really, lately haven't been drinking a lot of pop, so I just haven't really had much of a, I need pop, give it to me now, lately. It's either like Pepsi or sometimes Mountain Dew, it's just in between those two. I usually like making suicides, if like we go to one of those places and like you can like click what you want and stuff. Yeah, I usually make suicides, so it's kind of a mixture. But, like, my favorite favorite is probably Pepsi. So, my favorite food. Ah. Uh, I don't think I actually really have a favorite food. Um. Probably has to be crab legs and dipped in butter. And you just want to sit there and eat them all day. I could literally probably sit there and, like, just eat that the rest of my life. I'm sure, like, I'll have, have to have, like, a few little meals things and you, you just can't live on meat obviously and butter because that's terrible what is your favorite dessert oh my gosh it's like you know those little oreo pies like they're beautiful <laughs> like oreo pods are like they don't really have to be a pie it just has to be like oreo crap just like all of the oreo and like the whipped creamish type stuff it just has to be like just anything kind of Oreo-ish. Not like I like those actually randomly better than actual Oreos. I mean, like I like Oreos. Oreos, don't get me wrong. Like they're really good and stuff. But like, like you can't sit there and like enjoy enjoy them without like having to sit there and like crunch and then make your mouth dry and stuff. So yeah, what is your favorite restaurant? How do you come up with all these freaking, freaking, freaking questions? <laughs> um, my favorite restaurant. Like, like I've been saying, like I don't go out much. I don't go out and eat different things. As in, um, restaurant, restaurant wise, like fast food wise, I'd rather not go there. Like, we haven't been eating much of that lately because we're trying to go healthy. So then now I'm just kind of like, I don't really have one. I mean, like, I've never really had one. Like, these first few questions, like, I'm so, like, <sighs> So, um, favorite restaurant is probably Golden Corral. Like, I eat very few things because I'm a very picky eater. So it's harder for me to actually go somewhere and pick out some bunch of things that I like so um closest to me would be Cracker Barrel which is like closer closer and then like I have to drive like an hour away to go to Golden Corral if I ever actually want to go there randomly so this will get into that what is your favorite horror movie so I really like The Ring like um as in kind of one of the more quote unquote recent like my older, old, like not really older, old, old, old one was like Gremlins, the very first Gremlins because I haven't seen the second Gremlins or I haven't seen The Ring 2, 
which is like because the ring 2 came out in the year of my birthday which is like I don't want to see it because I didn't know there was a second one to last year and then I watched the ring two years ago when I was 12 so and then like I really like that and then the my favorite horror movie as an animated would probably be the nightmare before Christmas because like, I have like a few shirts just with the nightmare before Christmas on it yeah okay um who is your favorite singer singer would it be a band <laughs> um I don't I can't think of a single singer because like I like rock and stuff like more of a, like alternative rock and like just a little bit of metal I don't really like metal that that much but like my singer singer oh my gosh um I really like Andy Black but like he's in a band but like he kind of sings on his own a little bit but like at the same time it's just kind of and also like social repose which I just kind of figured out him like it's sad because like I like his impersonations and like him making like his YouTube channel and stuff like I'm sorry if like this pops up I don't really know what that is from the light but like I like him imitating different people and I like him doing like the songs I actually know and then when I actually kind of listen to his songs like they're a little bit slow and drawn out but like I really love him like I really love his imitations I like I love his YouTube channel it's just so weird just like when it comes to his actual songs I'm like a little bit draggy because they're kind of slower so so and then who is my favorite actor and actress so that's question seven and eight who's my favorite actor and actress oh my gosh I never know people's actual names so like I might want to touch it okay I never know what people's actual names are so I'm kind of like stuck in the deep dark depressing corner so actor um have you ever seen the moral instruments city of bones it's a movie and jace the character who plays jace whalen in that one i kind of like him but i've only seen him in two movies and then also like i just kind of like both the jaces because they're awesome and alec oh my gosh <laughs> and um shadow hunters a new uh show I really like them like I don't know their names so I'll probably have to look it up but I don't really feel like it right now but like just <laughs> Alec and Jace in the show is just like oh what but that's good that's like a whole different the whole different um, video getting me caught up on shadow hunters and crap I read up different different thing okay and then actress <sighs> there's this what like the secret circle she played in the secret circle she was a blonde on there and then um my new life or something i can't remember and then triple dog the movie she played in like she was a blonde and like chapin she was chapin on um the triple dog and then lux on like the my new life or something so what is your favorite television show? Oh, <laughs> television as in what plays in my area? Um, what plays in my area would probably be like as in TV right now because Black Butler doesn't play in my region of the world. Unless if I go on Netflix or YouTube and I'm just like, oh my gosh. Oh, oh, Miraculous Ladybug plays. I don't really know why I'm so obsessed with that show but um yeah and shadow hunters plays where I am like so I like shadow hunters like I was saying earlier so do you prefer a one piece or a two piece fancy two piece because I hate one piece feels like I'm squished because I'm more of a taller person so like it makes it like me like squished down into like a little compact thing because, like, my legs aren't halfway short, but then, like, my torso is longer, so it makes me feel like I'm being squished into a one piece. So, it just sucks. Okay. I <laughs> just question 11, and I've been talking for 11 minutes. So, wow. Are you a fan of wrestling? No. Uh-uh. Have you ever gone skinny dipping? Nope. Were you ever dared to do something extreme? No. No, no, no. What is your biggest thrill? 
my biggest thrill. I don't really know. I really like roller coasters and stuff. So, uh, do you have any hidden talents? I don't really know if acting would be a hidden talent because that's about the only thing I'm kind of good at. Because I get told that I'm a really good actor and I can do a British accent. Because when I did a play, I had to do a British accent and I've been accidentally talking British and I did in that recent video, which I didn't mean to, but I talked a little bit British. And since I've done that play, I've always tried to t not talk British, but I've been talking British. So, if I accidentally go British, I am sorry. What were you afraid of when you were a kid? So, I think... Kinda... So, when I was little, before, like when I was five through seven, I think, is when I had my old house. So, in my old house, I had my bed, it was against the wall. So, and then, like, my whole room was pink and everything, yeah. When I was little, I was very pink obsessed. And, like, I had a tiny little bathroom that only had a sink. But, like, we had a bathroom, if you go, like, a teeny bit down the hallway, as in, it's, like, right beside my room. And, like, the shower was, like, right beside my little tiny bathroom. But there was a wall there. But, like, that little hole cut out, so where you can get to, like, the heater and everything, they just left a hole in my wall. Like, my dad didn't bother to fill in the hole in my wall. So, I freaked out. Like, something was going to crawl out and eat me in the middle of the night. I was scared. Of like, when those lights went out, don't turn off my TV or I will kill you. <laughs> like, it scared me half to death that somebody turned off my TV. Like, I, they said I would get up as soon as you turned off my TV. I would freak out. Cause there's a hole in my wall and something's gonna come and freaking eat me in the middle of the night if my TV ain't on. So, <laughs> I'm gonna die. <laughs> um, do you sing that? <laughs> yeah, I listen to music or YouTube videos in the shower, so. Have you ever gone tanning? As in, I don't really know what that is really. Well, I mean, as in, uh, tan as in going out to the beach, yeah, but like going out getting an actual spray tan, no. Like I've done it myself just to be stupid and I was orange in the morning, so don't do that. So then, have you ever slept naked? No. No, actually. <laughs> have you ever had a near death experience? Yes, actually. I about got hit by a car. Literally. Because, so, me and... Uh, Destiny, we were walking back from my library, so I had this bright idea to just run across the road as I like to go to my house. So I started to go meow and like I did like little swirls, and then like there's just this car coming by and going meow, and like I'm just like oh my gosh, and so I swerved back and like I tackled Destiny because I about got hit by a car and I about died, and oh, I, like it still scares me today <laughs> about how terrifying that was. Did you ever fall asleep in the bathtub? Many times. How long can you hold your breath underwater? I've actually done it for three minutes before. Like, it was, I was like on the verge of like. <laughs> but now I can, like normally without choking to death, I can do about two minutes. Cause I like to go swimming. And like when I was like literally probably two, three years ago, when I was 11, I was convinced I wanted to be a mermaid. Most people like that go in there and like are all bubbly aquariums and stuff I was convinced I was gonna be one of those people so uh yeah so um I covered 22 I covered those 22 questions URCS0388 for giving me something to actually think about and actually do and make sure some of you other guys put that down in the comments and if you watch one of my older older ish videos as I said I wanted 50 subscribers by April which we didn't do which was my birthday in April so we didn't do that which we caught 40 I think it's 46 we have 46 subscribers so we have 46 people in our family right now well and then there's me 47 so we have 46 people in our mythical family which is 
awesome. So I am I has best unicorn. You tell me who you are down in the comments, what mythical creature you'd be, if you could be one, or if you are one already. And then make sure to give this video a thumbs up and make sure to also put in the comments what else I should do on these videos and just other random stuff and who if you have somebody you would like to come back from my other videos like Destiny or Brittany or somebody like that. Y'all can put that in the comments down below and I guess I will see you guys later. So if today was your birthday, have a mythical birthday and I have Spice Unicorn out.